it's October 1st, and we're going to take a hike up that alluvial fan over there. The alluvial fan itself is the sediment deposited over thousands or millions of years that basically spreads across the whole screen here. Last year we hiked up that one on November 1st, and we thought we'd try this one. Our camp is out there somewhere near the base of the dunes. Just taking a little hike up the alluvial fan. Rocks. Lots of rocks pushed by water. We're on sort of the more recently formed part. Just gonna go a little ways and see what there is to see. Not much shade, but just enough for us to hide in for a few minutes. Finding whatever is the easiest way. We're thinking of trying to make it there. Oh, I see it. Okay. Yeah, that's our destination. Checking out the wash. We got some nice shade in there. Take a look around. I'll climb up and see what's over this little ridge. You can see running fresh. And here is a mostly defunct piece of the wash. been one other vehicle left here on Sunday afternoon and they are leaving. Looks like Eureka Valley's all ours for now. Ninety-three in the shade. Very nice. So many layers. One of the things I really like about this area is the layers and the rocks. Look at those pronounced layers. And then look at how the same layers are a hundred feet higher over here and tilted at a different angle. Old piles, and the fresh river of rock. And it combines, it keeps going down that way. It's about to widen out and then we'll flatten out in no time and we'll be back at our camp. Nice little look up an alluvial fan here. Geology in action. And we followed the wash all the way down. That's it. It just peters out into nothing. Sun's going down, the wind's kicking up. All right, pretty good little hike. We're just camped just across the flat part there.